right now I'm with Brandon. Brandon, tell everybody who you're with. Hi, I'm Brandon Hartness. I'm the owner of Southeastern Auto Works, located here in Cartersville. How long have you been in business here? I've been at this location for about seven months now. And how's it going? It's going good. Can't complain. Uh, business is good. Now, what, what exactly do you do here? Uh, we are a paint and body shop. Uh, we do anything from custom, collision, restoration, uh, all the way to wholesaler work. So if I've got a three-inch scratch on my car that's just bugging me, can I bring it here? Absolutely. Uh, we do wet sand and buff. We offer detail. Um, our minor repairs, we mix our own paint here so we can color matches no problem. Um, and we basically just paint and body shop and do a little bit of everything. Right now you're standing in front of a real neat looking car. Tell everybody what this car is. This car is a 1956 Ford Custom Line, four-door. Uh -huh. um, it's, it's a four-door car. We're going to put the two-door the two paint scheme on it. Um, we've done a little modern work to it. We've upgraded the vacuum wipers to an electric wiper and we're going to add seat belts. They didn't come with seat belts. Um, we've got all the body work done on it. Uh, we're fitting the panels and then we're going to have it ready for paint uh, here in the next week or so. You have to custom make all this stuff or do you just look for old body parts? Well, this car, it had a couple, um, the paint was falling off and it had some rust holes in it. So we patched up some holes with new metal and uh, just kind of worked it from there. Uh, some, some of the stuff we do fab up if it's a really rare car that you can't get parts for. And uh, some of it we, we can order the panels as well. Is this a rich man's hobby? I would say so. Uh, it's, it's not, I don't know, a rich man's hobby, but uh, you, you definitely got to have money to play. So, mm -hmm. Well, tell everybody again who you are and who you're with. I'm South, uh, Brandon Hartness at Southeastern Auto Works. We're located in Cartersville and 10 Eagles Court. And thank you very much for joining us, Brandon. Thank you. Right now, I'm in about a hundred year old home right off Main Street. Uh, I want to introduce you to Bailey Jack. How you doing, Bailey? I am fine. How are you? You are an artist here yes. in uh, Cartersville area. That's correct. How long have you been an artist? I've been about 30 years. I became a working artist just a couple years ago. So I'm loving it. And I'm glad you like my humble kitchen. Oh, I love your <laughs> kitchen. I, I wanted to start this off in the kitchen because it's just a... It's, it's, uh, it's so streamlined, isn't it? Well, I like these. I like these old homes. This is an older home, and these older homes have personality. Yeah, this is. I mean, and it's plaster walls, and it's mm -hmm. and it's the heart pine floors, which I love. Mm -hmm. And it's nothing glamorous, but I did have a significant birthday party with seventy people here, so it just worked out okay. You don't have to have a lot, and especially you just want to be around people. So you're an artist. Are you an eccentric? <laughs> Some people say I am, but I'm eccentric because people know me at Home Depot, Ace Hardware, and the Bartow County um, dump because I use reclaimed items. I show me show me some of your reclaimed items. Okay, cool. Let me follow you around yeah, here. Yeah, and it's fun to do it, too, because I always learn a little bit of history about it. Right. And I've got a friend who makes me, um, out of beadboard, out of collapsed homes before it goes into the dump, he makes me my frames. And as you can see, I attach the wood behind it, and I paint my paintings onto here. Mm -hmm. Or like Ken, Kenny Reeves is a friend of mine. And you'll go to the dump and find wood like this. Well, the, he does. He finds yeah. that when the houses are collapsed and they're going to bulldoze it. Right. He has to pull all the nails out, get all the bird poop off, <laughs> clean it up. Yeah. Make it look good for me. Uh huh. But that's the original paint. Everything on here is original paint. When everybody tries to make things look distressed, this is truly distressed a wood, you know. And mm -hmm. this is an old window because I love doing big pieces, large pieces. Some people's houses are larger. 
and I'm known for my animals and my St. Francis and my interiors like this, which I love painting. And we're in my fabulous dining room with only two table, two chairs. But right. I just pull up a lot of them. That's all you need. That's, That's all, all you need. need. There's, yeah. there's your living room. Yes. Fabulous. I look right off of the street, which is kind of cool, too. You know, so you get to look. You really feel like you're in a community. I've always lived in uh, cul-de-sacs. Mm -hmm. So this is kind of new, you know, because I'm from Atlanta originally also. But I love the plaster walls. I hated it at first, and then I found out it does speak character to it. It does. It does. Show us your studio. Oh, okay. We're going we're gonna to volley you it, back to your it's studio. It's so humongous. I don't know. There'll probably be a lot of echoes in there. It's a nice studio. Yeah, that's right. That's why I want to see it. <laughs> that's right. Or this is where all the magic happens. <laughs> right? But I, I've learned just to put all my paints in one area. But people, I want to tell you my secret, David. Mm -hmm. I use house paint by Ralph Lauren. That's what I paint with. Yes, I do. So when you get a painting from me, you're getting designer paints. I found out these have them beautiful shades and colors, and, and you can't get them from everywhere else, and I love them. So I started using house paint, which cut my cost. Right. So when you're in any kind of economy, you got to think smarter. Right. And, I mean, it's still the same paint, but I just love it. Is that Walter Matthau? That's my baby. Yeah, he was just awesome. <laughs> he, that's when I used to paint on canvas, and I loved that man. I thought he was hilarious. I couldn't quit laughing, so I said... Everybody else has a Monet or something print. I have an original Walter Matthau that I painted. So you got to have something. I used to answer the phone and say, Walter and I are not here right now. Leave a message. Because <laughs> you are eccentric. Oh, well, okay. I am. I was in a coma at one point. Really? Yeah, I was. Why were you in a coma? I, I, I was birthing my first child, and I was in a coma about three days, and that's when I started my my method of painting. I paint everything black, mm -hmm. and I draw with white chalk, because mm. I can't look at a white canvas and start painting. I That was one part of it. Fascinating meeting you, Bailey Jack. Thank you. Say goodbye to everybody. Goodbye, everybody. Bye, Art. <laughs>